Hello, welcome to Bluebeam tutorial. This is exporting measurement data into Excel. So once we've recorded our measurement data on the drawing, we can export this information into an Excel format. All the measurement data is shown, or notes as, as well, as are shown in this separate frame at the bottom of the screen. This can be made smaller or larger by hovering your mouse over the thick gray line. You can sort the information by double clicking or clicking onto the headers. If you've got a lot of information, you can search that information. You can filter, gives you a drop down box. We've got a columns which we can select information that we want to see. good to select several different options within here because even if you undertake the measurement in let's say for example an area format like this has been undertaken Bluebeam will still give you measurements for the length which is the perimeter of the foundation gives us the area gives us the volume because we've entered a depth into the depth category box it will give me the width and the height so it'll give me the width and the height of the foundation and it will give me measurements which is the the primary measurement function that I undertook to export it into Excel we go to summary CSV summary come up with an option box select the following tick boxes because there's a drop down box, we can have markups, totals, or markups and totals. I leave it as selected as markups. Select OK. It'll ask me where I want to save the information. As default, it'll come up to where the drawing has been saved, which is in 2.5 daily records, Bluebeam, subfolder structural. It'll say save as type CSV file. So it only gives me two options CSV or all files. So select CSV file, click save, the document will automatically open up as a CSV file. So it looks like an Excel workbook, but it's a, it is a CSV file format. So we want to save as to an Excel workbook. You see as it will come up as save as type Unicode text. We want to save as an Excel workbook. Again, within the 2.5 daily records Bluebeam folder, click save. When we access that information, you see that we've got two different types of file within that folder. The Microsoft comma separated values file, which is a CSV file and the workbook or the Excel worksheet, we can actually delete the comma separated file just to leave with that information. 